Hello world, I'm Rich and this is Rich's World Beer Tour. We're into week two of Stout Weeks and then I'm done. Uh, today we're staying a little closer to Minnesota. We have got uh, from Tyra Nina Brewing Company. That's what you're looking for. Lake Mills, Wisconsin. Uh, down and dirty chocolate oatmeal stout. What's not to love there? Um, I think I've had this for about a year. There is not one identifying mark on this bottle. No ABV, no uh, date of bottling, no nothing. It is 6.5%. I looked it up. Um, nothing. No date. But I think I've had this for a year. So it's been just sitting down in the, I think I grabbed it off a single shelf uh, last year. So let's get a little look on her here, see what we're all about. Well, so much for head. <laughs> so much for head. There you go. About a fingernail's worth. Nah, maybe a quarter inch. Uh, not a lot going there. Hopefully, uh, it's perfectly black. Maybe a little brown hue around the edge, uh, looking right at the light. But hopefully, she didn't lose it through the cap. And getting on, getting some coffee and chocolate. That's about it. Kind of uh, a malty chocolate, that uh, malted milk ball uh, smell. Real light chocolate and just a hint of coffee. Not a lot on the nose other than that, that malted milk ball chocolate. The coffee is really subtle. Let's give it a go. Cheers world. Got it right around 50 degrees, um, which most of the stouts I've been drinking have been right, right around in there. Nice mouthfeel. Um, I get coffee. There's a little stickiness uh, to my mouth. It, it, the taste I'm getting is coffee right off the bat. I get a little bit of dark chocolate, a little bit of that malted milk ball that I was talking about that it was on the nose. Getting that in the in the taste, there is a sticky stickiness to uh, to your mouth after it's done. Six point five. I don't taste any alcohol. I don't sense that at all. Um, I'm just getting that that lingering coffee. Um, oatmeal, chocolate oatmeal. I mean, I'm getting the, the uh, chocolate. It is smooth, so I'm sure that's the oatmeal in there just smoothing things over. No rough edges on this at all. The lingering coffee bitterness that I'm tasting. It, it leaves me wanting more. Uh, more in this beer, more something, some more chocolates, some more body to it. Uh, it. It is a, if it's right on the medium mouthfeel, it's just a bit thinner than that. Um, it just wants what I'm wanting now that I've had a week plus of stouts. I want something that's just a little bit more, a little more chewy, a little more flavor, a little more complexity. I get that, that chocolate, I get that coffee, and that's about it. It is smooth. There's nothing wrong with it. I'm just looking for more. Um, this is a, a nice solid B beer. You know, this is an 8 out of 10. Um, just easy drinking. Like I said, that alcohol's hidden. Um, if anybody, uh, you know, somewhere Wisconsin brewers, maybe our Minnesota ones, if you've seen this, let me know what you're thinking about it. Uh, Down and Dirty Chocolate Oatmeal Stout, Lake Mills, Wisconsin, Tyra Nina Brewing Company. That's the label. That's what you're looking for. Um, you know, nice, nice solid beer. Just nothing, nothing jumping at me and and uh, really, really hitting me in the face with something tremendous. Uh, it's a good beer. Um, thanks for sharing a beer with me, world. We got a few more to go. Cheers.